Well, it's been a tough year with COVID-19 and with the country starting to rebound and vaccines being readily available, some folks are having a little fun on social media. 12 News investigator Letitia Kay takes a look at something that they're calling the magnet challenge that is <laughs> sweeping social. Ever heard that saying, believe half of what you see and none of what you hear? Well, according to Dr. Masanti Levine, that's typically the approach you should take when watching social media videos. So take a look at these. Magnet. Have you seen the COVID vaccine magnet challenge? These videos show people sticking a magnet to the arm they got the COVID-19 vaccine shot in. So a viewer emailed to ask, does the COVID-19 vaccine contain metal or microchips? Our sources are the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the American Academy of Family Physicians, and Beaumont-based Dr. Masanti Levine. There are a couple schools of thought behind these theories. One, older vaccines used a compound that contained mercury, which is a type of metal. As far as I know, this mRNA vaccine, as well as the viral vector that the other companies are using, don't contain any appreciable amounts of any sort of metal. The CDC website lists the vaccine ingredients for each type of vaccine. No metal or mercury is listed. We can verify there is no mercury in any of the COVID-19 vaccines. And according to the American Academy of Family Physicians, quote, there are no electronic components in the vaccines. The mRNA, lipids, salts, and other stabilizing agents are routinely used in other medicines. We can verify there are no microchips in the COVID-19 vaccine. I don't understand the advantage of putting a microchip or the, having that understanding again, because just using our cell phone right here, this is all the recording information that any governmental agency needs. Though social media sites like TikTok, Instagram, and Twitter or Facebook can be informative, videos posted can be altered. So Dr. Levine suggests finding accredited medical sources. Again, credible sources, peer reviewed, where we know the information is appropriate and it's accurate, and it takes precedent in terms of providing safe information. The CDC website has you covered for that, too. So we can verify there are no metals or microchips in the COVID-19 vaccine. So maybe you're still left wondering, how did the magnet stick in those videos? Well, remember the old stick a spoon on your nose trick? These videos could be similar, where moisture on your skin helps make a lightweight object stick or even just use special effects. Now, if you have something you want us to verify, send a message to our email, verify at 12newsnow.com or message us on one of our social media accounts.